Four years ago, I was diagnosed with breast cancer. Unfortunately, my cancer was aggressive and I underwent surgery within a very short time. My surgery was followed by several courses of chemotherapy using drugs that were very toxic. Chemotherapy is a gruelling experience and my journey especially so. Whilst I was having chemotherapy, I had four episodes of neutropenic sepsis, which is blood poisoning. Each episode was life-threatening and each episode needed urgent and immediate treatment with high doses of antibiotics. I also relied heavily on antibiotics for several wound infections at the site of my mastectomy. Several times the antibiotics that doctors first used were not effective and several times I had to change my treatment to find something that would work. When doctors told me I had cancer, I thought chemotherapy would be my main lifeline. I was right, but only because of the availability of effective antibiotics, and they saved my life on many occasions. They kept me alive during my chemotherapy. Before cancer, I really didn't know that chemotherapy just isn't possible with antibiotics. Before cancer, I'd heard that you don't need antibiotics for coughs and colds, but to be honest, I didn't really take it too seriously. I just didn't know how vital they are to other areas of medicine. I'm aware that antibiotic resistance can have devastating effects. And I was fortunate that there were antibiotics that worked for me. I make sure now I use antibiotics only when I need them and I make sure my family do the same. I urge you to do the same. You see, it'll help me and other cancer survivors like me to remain survivors.